hello everyone here's a question on ratios and the question is compare the given ratios 1 is to 5 and 1 is to 4 now comparing the ratios is similar to comparing to the fractions and uh, see let's see how to do this so there are two ways of solving it one is the easiest way and one is uh, one where you have a, a couple of steps to solve it so I have written the ratio 1 is to 5 and 1 is to 4 I'm going to explain the easiest way first we have learned that ratios can be written in a fraction form so 1 is to 5 will be equal to 1 by 5 and 1 is to 4 will be equal to 1 by 4 right now how to compare them so here uh, this is the easiest way you have to just cross multiply cross multiply means this 5 will get multiplied with 1 and the 4 will get multiplied with 1 this is just cross multiply them okay the denominator will get multiplied with the numerator of the other ratio or the other fraction so 4 ones are 4 and 5 ones are 5 now compare the product after multiplying what answer you got you just compare that so which one is greater 4 is greater or 5 is greater 5 is greater than 4 which means 1 by 4 will be greater than 1 by 5 that's it this is the easiest way cross multiply the numbers and see which product is greater so that ratio or that fraction will be greater so 1 is to 4 is greater here now this one was an easy one now I'm going to show you how to do the uh, other method where you're going to have a few steps now this the second method which I'm explaining you it is similar to comparing the fractions so 1 is to 5 and we have 1 is to 4 so this is equal to uh, 1 by 5 and this is equal to 1 by 4 right now you have learned that in the fractions when you're comparing the first is you have to check if denominators are same if they are same it's good you can directly compare the numerators and then you can write down the answer just which one is greater and that fraction will be greater but here in this case like we have a different denominators so we have to make it same once they are denominators are same then we can compare the numerator but how to do this so we're going to take the LCM we're going to take the LCM of the denominator that is 5 and 4 so 5 and 4 LCM will be 20 now I'm going to change the number I'm going to make the denominators 20 for each fraction so first we have 1 by 5 uh, it's like finding the equivalent fraction where denominator will be 20 so you have learned that when you're finding the equivalent fraction you have to multiply or either you can divide so here in this case we're going to multiply because you have to multiply to get the 20 if you divide you will not get 20 so we have 5 and we have 1 so with this 5 what you should multiply to get 20 so we have to multiply with 4 so same 4 you multiply in the numerator so 1 4 is a 4 and 5 4 is a 20 so you have learned this method right this is like finding the equivalent rational uh, equivalent fraction so 1 by 5 equivalent fraction is 4 by 20 similarly for the next number which is 1 by 4 we have 1 by 4 so with this 4 what we should multiply to get 20 in the denominator so that number will be 5 so same 5 you should multiply in the numerator also so 1 5 is a 5 now see we got the denominator same 20 we got now we can easily compare the numerators so we're going to just uh, write down this number once again so we have 4 by 20 and we have 5 by 20 in the easy way also I have showed you we got 4 and 5 right we have compared 4 and 5 here also we have got 4 by 20 5 by 20 like I said before we're going to have a 2 3 steps extra uh, than the previous method now just compare them compare the numerator 5 is greater than 4 so 5 by 20 will be greater than 4 by 20 which means we have uh, 4 by 20 is equal to 1 by 5 right 1 by 5 and 5 by 20 is equal to 1 by 4 so 1 by 4 will be greater than 1 by 5 now if you want to write down the ratio form so 1 is to 5 will be less than 1 is to 4 or 1 is to 4 is greater than 1 is to 5 that's it so I hope uh, you understood how to compare the ratios now in case you have any other question or doubt you can drop a comment thank you so much for watching